My name is Kajol Rekha and I am 23 years old. In 2003, I had an accident. I fell over a chair and one of my vertebrae slipped and severed my spinal cord. Now I am paralyzed. Before the accident, my life was good. I was living with my parents and going to school. And then they both suddenly died. My brothers looked after me and arranged my marriage. However, after my accident, my husband left me and remarried. It was difficult and painful. I suffered a lot. Previously, I was treated with affection by everyone in my family. But that all changed. I was neglected and I became a burden to everyone. Life became much better for me once I was given my wheelchair. I used to be totally dependent on others, but now I can get out and move around. I received income generation training from a local development agency in growing vegetables and rearing chickens and ducks, then purchased a hand sewing machine and now draw an income by tailoring garments for people in my village. My house was modified to meet my basic needs such as sanitation, making safe drinking water and my lavatory accessible. It was also raised to reduce the impact of the floods. When it comes to floods and other disasters, people with disabilities are particularly vulnerable. There is generally widespread panic and in many cases, a person with a disability is forgotten and left behind. So now I am part of a disaster preparedness committee and we've made a list of all people with a disability in our area and we can take immediate steps to locate and evacuate them. I am also responsible for educating people about hygiene and general health for when the waters hit, such as how to protect their food against insects and contamination. Previously, I was afraid of the prospect of flooding, but now that we are prepared, I know what to do and I can face it. Now I am no longer a burden to my family and I am proud that I am a valuable and contributing member of my community.